That's a bit better. Alright, um... Anyone can see the world though? Which one? Uh, either one. Doesn't matter. They should both give me the... Uh, same rules. Oh, uh, I gotta plug in the microphone. That's right. What's wrong with the heroes? I guess they're technically heroes, but it's not... Well, I guess they're like... Not that it might fall much better, but... Alright. in. We are playing Boss Monsters. Um... Actually, I have to look at my titles. And it's just up in there, in front of the cards. Are you two of the four? Yes. Are most of the cards are them? Shuffle? Um, they're separated. Okay. And you need to be shuffled? Yeah, I'm not the yet. Okay. I remember last time I played this, I think it was what, like, November? Probably. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I think I only won back then, last time I played. Cody, you've only played this once, correct? Yep. Oh, 
healings now. You have the boss monster to live well. So we'll do a normal uh, thing where we each go in circle and draw a boss monster. Then you can choose to keep it or redraw on your boss monster. <coughs> um, for those who have never played boss monster before, the objective of the game is to kill as many heroes as possible. I guess the reason I have that there. Uh, you want to get 10 souls from heroes. Uh, to win or be the last boss monster standing, because if a hero makes it through, your boss monster gets a wound. If you take five wounds, you lose. And the, or you, if you want to show them right there, you show them. okay, then draw your first card, and then just pass it around. I know you guys have to stretch a little bit, but try to keep your board if you can on the map. That's going to be very rough. Yeah, I know. If you can't, it's alright, but try and do your best. I where my hand is. Oh god, that's way off. So there's nothing right here. It's like barely in right here. You will almost face this after breakfast. I have plenty of room here. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> Alright, that's what I do. Okay. We're going to turn around and pick. I was just doing a draw, so we can do that too. I want to keep No, I like mine. Alright. Alright, I know it's your voice because it's a different color. Mm -hmm. I know that I'm the voice. Alright. Alright, so everyone now draw five cards from the room deck. Start by putting one room down. Mm -hmm. things. Okay. Yeah. And then we go in order of who puts rooms down based on its P. Oh, the clips. Oh, you're right. Fuck your monster first. You're right. I got a beautiful looking dragon. Me too. Back in there. Me too. Oh. Are we all dragons? No. Except for Cody. <laughs> Close enough. So my ability is great though. It's like I go first. <laughs> yep, you have 975. Okay, so I'm still lowest. Mm -hmm. Okay. I thought so actually that's. Oh no, yes. I have 500 XP. Oh, that's fine. I thought that was 300. Okay. It was Evan, me, Emmy, Cody. I just got 100 goals. We're not playing with items, are we? No, no. if you have an item card. Yeah, it. this one This one specifically works with items. Yep, so just dispose of it. Why not, but... We haven't played enough to like really put down items, because I just think it's a little more confusing. Also, I don't know if we know where those are. They're, yeah, I haven't somewhat. I saw them recently.
But yeah, I got 100 rolls for getting everything silver in Pennsylvania. <laughs> Which is also the map that I'm on, and my favorite theme so far. Oh, spelling mistake. <clears throat> I got all of those. They don't call me the grin or not, you can melt it. I'm trying to have to shut that hand a little bit. Alright, um, I'm trying not to look at every hand. So, everyone put down a room card when you have one you want to put down. And then we reveal them in EXP order. No, you place them down in EXP order. Oh, you're right. And then you reveal all at once. It's been a while, man. It's been a while. We play a lot of games on the show. I'm fine with you. Maybe you should hold it for the robot. Mm. Mm, so I'm not even using. <laughs> there. I put one down. Alright. That's up. We only like to win. That's the way I like to fly. Is it your turn, sir? Yeah, it is. I go next. Ooh. This is the belt stick, right? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna play motivation. If you have fewer rooms and an an opponent, which is seven. You do not have any rooms yet. Can you count the room yet? No, it's not built. Alright, you're fine. I don't have a good hand. Me neither. I haven't even bothered looking at my hand yet. It's gonna be a surprise. <sighs> Although now we know what one of Sammy's cards are right off the bat. Whatever. Night right, card. When do we draw a book card? Hmm. Alright. You already started this wrong. Maybe. Begin your turn, reveal heroes in town. Right. Sorry, I One hero per player. Why didn't you read the directions first? I did. No, you didn't. I missed one. I'm about to be a... Mage. Thief. Fighter. Hitman. During the beginning of turn phase, the following occurs. Heroes appear in town. And then each player draws a card. One room card. This will be our town. What does the hearts mean again? The heart is how much damage you do to a hero. Oh, yeah. uh, so for the lowest hero heart is 4, and the highest is 8. So, we all should have drawn a room deck card. Is this the way here? My other one? Yes. Okay, so we have 6. Um... Give everyone the opportunity to redo the build phase now. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Evan, you go first. <laughs> it's been a while, man. Nah, I'm good. Nah. Sometimes I wonder how I'm the one with autism. Yeah. Hmm. <clears throat> so we started off face down. Yeah. Room. Don't forget your spells. Hmm. Ooh, I got some geeky shit. Alright, empty though. My spells are really good at least. <laughs> Alright, so we got a mage, a Jew, another Jew, and a fighter. One, two, three, reveal. The Goblin Armory. Magnetic ceiling. And it's our maze. Laboratory. I will do my three. Got two describe one. That's a good card. Yes. Everyone is set, so now we just. No. Nope. Still 
still using the ability. Okay. Then we decide what hero goes where. <laughs> well, the Jews are going to <coughs> Cody. Yeah, they the are. The fighter's going to you. And then the mage goes to them. Mm -hmm. Discard That's such a dicky card. <laughs> Alright, that's in the discard pile. The A's. Okay. Mage goes to them. Fire goes to me. And at least we go to Cody. The Hitman. Someone can discard a room with a treasure icon to give the Hitman a plus three health. Uh, that's, you put an advanced trap room now. Yes, sorry. Um, so advanced cards, you have to play them on top of another card with the same uh, icon. Doesn't have to be another uh, trap room, but the same icon. <clears throat> if you don't put a treasure room down, you won't get hit by the Jews. Also, Emmy, do you want to spark the dog? Yes. Sorry, do you want to spark oh, the It won't work because then me and M will be matched. Correct, because that means they won't go anywhere. Yeah, it means the major will go. They stay in town until there's someone left them more higher up there. Welcome. That. Welcome, next gen. Hello. Fuck it, I'll just build Dark Altar. Alright. So the Jews go back to town. Does anyone else want to sparkly dawn? Yo, put your ding dong in my mouth. Jesus. Sparkly dawn for you. Sparkly dong for you. Sparkly dong for you. Sparkly dong for me. Welcome next gen. <clears throat> Welcome to a, this year, uh, your first board game. Dude, we haven't done yeah. this since a year. Swear to God, Sam. Is it my turn? Uh, yes. Or, well, no, you don't have nobody. You gotta do your. Yep. So I have a um, spell where I need a six sided die. Alright, uh, for sure. One, two, three, somewhere. Yeah, I'm not going to that. Oh, over there. Is it? Spider. Take one. Damage with me. Sound, I need the one again. Where is mine? Um, uh, don't worry, these were, what, like, two for five at Dollar General? Super cheap, and they're sparkly dogs. Alright. Nothing is coding. Mage hits M. For a wound. Mm -hmm. oh. Now we're back on top of the order, where we draw heroes. Fighter. Mm -hmm. Fuck me. Barbarian. Fuck me. Mage okay. and Mage. Wow. Nice. Draw. Mm -hmm. Bitch, I love me some hot tag. All next videos. Bitch, I'm debating for my dick in your Cheerios. Alright then. Also, next gen, uh, next gen, I don't know what your plans are for today, but after this, we'll be moving on to our Yu Gi Oh tournament for the weekend. Yeah. Oh, no, I drank in the cup. I told you that. I actually left a drink on the porch. Alright, that's a different drink that we should But that's only because I couldn't fit in the fridge, and it's colder outside in the porch than it is in the fridge. It's chocolate milk, guys, come on. <laughs> Really good job. All right, you have any played your card? Mm -hmm. All right. 
Don't be, excuse me, I'm gonna go grab my drink. Also, I don't want to put my shirt on, so I'm gonna make it really fast. My jacket on, I should say. I was gonna say, you taking it off first? Alright. Said nudes. Destroy this room, steal your spell. What'd you do? I destroyed my room to steal that spell. You still get to play. I have some really dicky spells I only want to add to the list of dickiness. Glad I didn't put the more dicky spell in there. I'm also gonna grab a drink. This is, but yeah, you already answered boss monsters. Mm. Um, I'm on it. I'll explain the rules in a second. We get to flip. Goblin Nursery. Centipede Tunnel. Dark Laboratory. <clears throat> when I build this room, I draw two spell cards and discard them. Mm. If this room is uh, to the left, if the room to the left is the monster room, give that room plus two. When you build this room, you may swap the placement of two rooms in any one dungeon. <laughs> I only have one room. What's per turn when you play a spell card, draw a spell card. Noise. That also means I'm not getting the mages. Sammy, I'm gonna swap the two rooms for shits and giggles just Thanks. because of the effect. <laughs> I can't use it on anyone else. I mean, you could've, but you could've you don't use it on me and fuck me over. Ah, uh, that's fine. <laughs> we need to eliminate Sam first. Yeah, like your liger's dead. I really don't like centipedes, though. Oh. Uh, so, next turn. This is boss monsters. So basically, the way this game goes, each player has their own boss monster. Uh, what you're... is the meaning of life? Good food? Good spirit? How is that a fortune? Um, your objective is every turn you build a room in your dungeon up to five rooms. Uh, and your goal is to try and kill the townsfolk. Um, uh, who come into your dungeon? Uh, the first person to get ten souls wins, or the last boss monster standing wins. And boss monster dies, or they take five wounds. <clears throat> yes. All right. So let's divide them up. The Jews still stay in town. The fighters come to me, and the mages go to. Evan. Alright. Evan first. <clears throat> Alright. Mage enters dungeon. I'm going to play uh, Annihilator. Giving a trap room plus three, so it is four. Counter spell. His Minotaur maze goes back to this, deals another four. Dead. GG? Dead. Alright, two souls for Evan. <clears throat> Alright, go to another room, takes one, three passes, and then this room takes one, three, and then I'll play lightning bolt, do another three damage to him, kill him. Yeah, boy. So you never run out of spells. Well, I'll play one turn. 
And then you guys have no When do we get to level up a factor? When you hit five rooms in your dungeon. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Townsfolk. Oh. Hey, I didn't go. Oh, yeah. I didn't you have nothing to go. I was well, gonna activate a spell, though. Cleric. Fighter. Thief. <clears throat> and cleric. Everyone draw off our room. Very nice. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's brutal. No problem. Next turn. What do you want to do? The icons of the match. <clears throat> yes. One of them? Yep. When you build a man's room? Yep. Oh, so the icons of the match? Just one of them or all of them? Just one. Just one. Can you activate a spell card at any time? Uh, so a spell card that has a hammer on it is during the build phase. A spell card that has an axe on it is during the attack phase. Okay. And it's uh, uh, that's both phases we can activate during any time. Um, and now it's just end build. Alright, I'll save that for a special uh. occasion. Okay. Hold on, I want to double check and make sure if I'm in the right room. Yep. Alright, one, two, three, flip. <laughs> Uh, Mega Room Burrow, when I build this, choose a destroyed one advanced room in any dungeon. I have Spectre Sanctum. When you build this room, choose an opponent that, uh, choose an opponent, that opponent discards a spell card, and choose you. Ah, oh, damn. I already have to discard a spell card. <laughs> oh, I get to dispel or <laughs> discard two of them. Well, I miss working on that. Uh, for a little more information, each boss monster has their own EXP. Evan has the highest with 975. Uh, Cody has the lowest with 500. Um, and so, every turn, uh, the person with the highest XP goes, he plays a card down, we just point EXP order, and at the end of everyone puts this in a room down, we flip reveal, then activate any effects, then the people from town will choose a dungeon to enter and attack. Oh, you're cheating. You're probably looking at cards on screen. <laughs> I can't see the cards like that. I'm blind. I can barely see. Uh... So who goes where? Uh, so I'm going to start a card. No I'm going to activate my Witch's Kitchen. My track card. Uh, I can destroy one card. Uh, one monster card in my dungeon, and then I get to draw a spell card. I'm going to destroy Goblin Nursery. Uh, it's discard a monster room and draw a spell. Oh, you're right, discard. I read that wrong. Still can do it, though. Why would you want to discard a spell, though? Or do you target somebody else? No, discard, discard a monster room yeah. and then draw a spell. Oh, I thought he had to discard both. I was like, damn, that doesn't seem useful, though. <laughs> Zombie prison. Alright, so now to the side rule goes where? Jews. Still in the center. Are you? Uh, cleric. We're tied. You and me. Yep. Stays. Fighter. It's the main. Uh, and they're same. Cleric. Okay, so everyone's still in town. I just get a fighter. Take me to pound town. <clears throat> Okay, so enter here, takes two damage, one, three, and then two more for five, dead. Oh, two souls, and how is this room? I have a hard time maintaining just one. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, we're all heroes. The thief. Getting all the fucking thieves. Fighter. Cleric. Thief. Alright. Uh, 
draw a card. One has to match or both? Or a match or one? Yeah, one more. Okay, good. My weave is cool. What do you want to build going? There you go. Alright. We're all set. Uh, one, two, three. Reveal. Ligard's dead. I'm going to use this ability to start monster room. I'll spell all. I'm going to play Motivation. If you have fewer rooms than an opponent, you may build an extra room this turn. If you play less rooms than Evan, they have uh, three rooms. Yeah. Fuck, dude, I thought I had four. Fuck, Evan, you keep ruining my plans. I use the arena. Once per turn, you may reveal a monster room from your hand to give this room a plus one until the end of the turn, where X is that room's power. Alright. I just want to play the fucking spell card, damn it. Alright. Thieves stay in town, don't they? No. Oh, you have another thief point. Okay. Yeah. Nice. God. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight. Five. Fuck. Five. I haven't drawn yet, have I? Oh, I did draw that one. Okay. Uh, clerics, are they still in town? Yes, boss. Yes, they are. Okay. And fighter goes to me. Uh, okay. So with that... What's your uh, first card you want? During both phase, you may destroy this room to choose one room in any dungeon or remove its treasure value until the end of turn. Okay. Fuck that. Who wants to help people? I'm gonna play a spell card freeze on your middle card. Okay. Freeze. So now it doesn't have any of its uh, damage or anything. This turn. Okay. Because I play a spell card, I can draw a spell card. Shortcut. He skips two rooms in your room. In your room then. Okay. Bitch. <laughs> okay. S snap hack to reality. Skips. Takes two damage and hurts me. Hmm. And that hurts me. <laughs> and that means all of these guys hurt me. Okay. You did. How many do I need to die? Five. Then yes. Sorry. No, you're not. Yes. Don't lie. I just wanted to play the freeze card. Okay. And this boss is dead. I took a wound. Draw heroes. Fucking. Hey, of course the Jews kill you. <laughs> <laughs> they Plan. were all Sam. Witch. Mage. I'm sorry. And then cleric. We're now at the uh, other ones. Did you ever look at my notes? Yes, I did. Okay. 
uh, draw one card. Oh, sorry, one card. Definitely with uh, like light stuff. Oh, yeah. Draw three room cards and give one player one of your room cards. <laughs> I'll cycle the duckies. Yeah. Alright, this is the build phase. Yeah. I activate zombie attack on one of Sammy's heroes. Choose a dead hero in an opponent's scorekeeping area, send it back to the entrance of that player's dungeon. Until the end of his turn, it has plus two health. The Barbarians, now he's a plus eight. There you go. And I get to draw a spell. <laughs> Alright. Uh... I'm going to use Fairy Fountain on that. Okay. Deal zero damage, and each creature entering it gets plus one health. Okay. Over the. Yeah, that's <laughs> Alright, are we gonna flip? Sent to be tunnel. Spawn point. Spectre Sanctum. Inspector, but I barely know her. <laughs> Alright. Um, okay, uh, some to be done with the effect. I can swap two rooms in any one dungeon. I'm gonna swap this room and this room. Alright, and I'm gonna play Party Up. Uh, on Evan's dungeon. For one, uh, choose one dungeon until the end of the turn. Each hero that enters that dungeon gains a plus one health. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> so, mages, what are you? Clerics are tied between all of us. And then, that's it. <laughs> What's that do? Sends back to town. Okay. We get a plus seven. Nina's at seven. Oh, yeah, sorry. Alright. And then I'm going to discard Centipede Tunnel so that he gets a plus three, bring to ten. 
Destroy a room, not destroy a room. Meaning it has to be in your hand, it has to be a Even spell. Even better. Thing. I have tons of content here that I don't want to need. Oh, yeah. easy. I swear I haven't seen one piece of mine. Call one of I just guarded that so that he gets to go to town. It has to be a. Oh, mage. mage. Sorry. So That's a, one. Give me your nuggets, put it in the right place. Oh, that's a fucking oh note to I just fixed it all. It looked beautiful. Sorry. Working in really tiny areas. Yes, right. Uh, I'm going to. Yo, here, just like a channel. Discard this since I can't in the witch's kitchen. Remember the discard room. Right there. Right here. Spell. Neanderthal cave. Fuck. <clears throat> if I would discard any other card, it would have worked better. <laughs> Really? Fuck. Yeah. Well, it's at what? Nine? Ten? Ten. Ten now. Well, two, three, four, eight. That's a wound. Give me a damage. Alright. And we're still sitting in with ship a load of clerics. Alright. Draw. Uh. Your barbarian has to go through. Oh yeah, you're right. Sorry. And this one deals nothing. Yep, one. And he has a plus. He has a plus two. Yes. Plus two. So it takes one. Uh, it takes two, three. That's three. It takes three. Dead. Oh, sorry. And then zero wound. And I fucked you over a soul. One more hit, and he's dead. The mage. The princess. Did another Necromancer. Yeah, if you Necromancer. And a thief. You're gonna draw a room. Because the thief is most definitely coming my way because fucking, uh. There's nowhere else for him to go. To, I don't know if I can't do that yet. Where does the princess go to? Most rooms. When the princess appears in town, each player may draw up to three spell or root cards. Then the base phase, the princess is alerted to the dungeon and the player with the most cards in hand. Which I think it may be me. So you get to draw things? Like yeah, so we, we can all get to draw either up to three room or spell cards. So up to three cards. That's, that's not, hero. That's hero. Whoopsies, I'm her. I can't see anything. Oh, Poppy. Alright. Welcome, Poppy. On our chat, your name is completely black. 
so it's hard to see against the black background. Uh, so you need to take five wounds for your boss to be defeated. I'm at four wounds currently, uh, and if uh, the other one condition is to get ten souls. Which Evan's at two, Cody's at zero, and I'm at one because Cody fucked over one of my souls. And then Cody's Sam fucked with all my souls, I'm so sorry. I'm dead. I made my name black to confuse all the people using dark mode. <laughs> no, it's not even dark mode. <laughs> Why would you do such a thing? Dark mode is so much prettier looking. Also, I've come look my computer. It really is. That's not my computer. It's a hard choice, isn't it, Cody? What to go with? Now I have regrets. Why? I like this one with regrets. It disconnected me from chat. It disconnected you from chat. I mean, I also have dark mode on. <laughs> Alright, I know the room. Um, okay. Let me just put this in real quick. I'm gonna play... I vote you go back to that one. I'm going back to dark mode because it looks pretty. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna okay. pick that up chat again. Okay. So uh, okay, I'll, I'll do this. Uh, I'll, I'll play little balls here. Right. Uh, I'm gonna play Princess in Peril. All right. Place one hero in town. Place it into my dungeon. I'll take the necromancer. Okay. Oh. This way. Yes. Right. Um. Okay. Are we gonna reveal it, or is everyone good? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Goblin armory. Flipperoni. I need a die. Angry garden. Always. Uh. Oh, I was gonna play that. I got five, so I get a level up. Um, before you get your level up, I'm gonna play Motivation. Now that you have five cards, I can play one more card this time. What? If you have more card, more, more rooms than I do, I can play one more room card. When can that be played? Go face. It's still face. So you should move yours a little bit further back. Uh, because yeah. then you're gonna be overlapping me. I can move it a tiny bit back. Hold on, I have my idea. Oh. I have to play one more card. Although I don't really think that's stupid because I don't know what card I want to play. When you guys need a draw, just tell me your end, which pile you're drawing from. Alright. I may or may not say no. And then I may or may not do it. <laughs> There we go, it looks semi prettier. A little easier to follow. Still can't see any of the uh, heroes, but that's fine. Yeah, yeah. it's because of the light. Yeah. Yeah. We need like a sheet to go over light. Alright. Okay, so I get mages. Oh, I have to get a draw. I need a spell card because I played spell card. Nope. <laughs> I almost saw what it was. Okay. So let's divide them up. Just have enough muscle mages. It's a hard not like. All right. What do we have in our hands for cards? <laughs> huh? What do we have in our hands for cards? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There you go, pal. Uh, I think we're still tied for cleric. Yep. Alright, so um, I'm gonna start this off by playing another castle, sending it Evan's way. Stop, yeah. Uh, well, Let's... I gotta wait for it to get in my dungeon, never mind. He needs to be inside me. Um, Thief is tied? I think I Thief have is one. One. Oh, one. yep. Okay, so tied. So those are all the cards to go in this turn. Oh, I was actually building for the Thief because I was worried it was gonna come in here. Um. Alright, so Zelda's gonna be on oh, my shit. Hold on real quick. Four. Oh no, real quick. Jeez Louise, Evan. I have to do my math. I'll do math. I'll do Four, math. Four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twen
Um, how much is it to kill you, homie? Oh, wait a second, honey. What's up? One, two, three, four. All right, you do that four hits. Yeah. I was making sure because these guys do two damage. Right. Yes, yeah, they're also difficult. I would like to free your final real weapon. Freeze! Counterspell! Don't have counterspell. I'm surprised none of us have drawn counterspell yet. Sam? It's a hard knock play for him. Did you have counterspell on it? I'm saying, there's so many uh, fucking cards, we uh, haven't seen half of them. There's like three counterspells, I thought. So, we should play this one. I'm gonna play. I only saw like two of them. What do you think? So then, this one, yeah. I'm gonna play a wild monster. Okay. Oh! I need to discard my. And it allows me to play Pokemon a monster appears. on top of another room. <laughs> okay. Now it's no longer frozen. Alright. Very nice. And then I will also play... Booty Hole Bandit. Uh, I'll eat it. <laughs> I'll play Super Effective. Okay. Another Pokemon game card. Damn it. <laughs> this will do it all on uh, Miss Your Clock Tower. Oh, not the Clock uh, Tower. I guess plus two damage until the turn, or a creature was lured to your dungeon this turn. The room gets plus four, which I lured the ne Necromancer there the this turn. Alright. So, it, it, it does eight. This first room does eight, so. Okay. Dead, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, dead. Um, and if, then, they're, if they're dead, you flip them the other way. Sorry. Yeah, they're all dead. Yeah. So Evan's at seven souls. Cody, run your princess through. Alright. She goes through Fang Root, takes two damage. Still gonna use another castle and send it to Evans. <laughs> Choose a hero in your dungeon and send it to the entrance of another opponent's dungeon. Okay, you should be able to use that when they're at the beat starting your dungeon. It's fine. So technically I want to take the damage first and you can still play that and put it in Evans. Well, because it said in your dungeon, so I didn't know if that means they are yeah, It's it. outside the dungeon, technically, so it has to go through the first room first. Doesn't it technically go into your dungeon when it starts on that side? <sighs> Rule time! <laughs> Let me pull up the lair because I can't think of it. <laughs> Sorry, right, that's the only part of that song I know as well. You know, eventually we're going to have to get uh, rid of these clerics. Here's a question. Yep. Uh, because a spell effect affects a room, uh, something gets built on top of it. Uh, if it goes back to the original room, is the spell still affecting it? I would say no. I would say no, because technically it's, it's, it's a like new, it's like yeah. building a new room. Building a new yeah. room. Yeah. Yeah. Heroes enter, starting with the first hero to arrive at an entrance to a player's dungeon. That hero begins to move through that player's dungeon. So it hasn't entered yet. Okay. So it takes it two and then you send it to Evan? Yep. Alright, that will bring Evan up to nine points. I just don't want to deal with it. Yeah. Okay. So then, that's uh... Um... Yeah, you could send it to me too. Yeah, but Evan's my biggest threat right now. So you're giving him more points? You're gonna let him win? Alright. So to... Two, eight, so 10, 12, 13, what? 14, 15. Destroy this room. So then I get the four back. Right, and then I can deactivate a room, but it doesn't really matter. Wait. Is hard knock life a crystal? Wait. Song? It just deactivates a room, doesn't say till the end of the turn. I believe everything resets at the end of the turn. It does? Because yeah, okay. only most stuff says it, re it resets. Or it says till the end of the turn. What does your freeze card say? Let's 
Choose to deactivate I one am. room in any dungeon. What do you mean? Why can't you believe me? So yeah, it resets okay. at the end of the Okay. Time. Okay, perfect. What? Um, Is it a Christmas song? Pee 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 pee. Is Annie a Christmas I've never movie? seen Annie. That's depressing. Who here has seen Annie? Alright, it's 50 50. Fuck off. Okay, uh, let us start by grabbing heroes. I need four heroes, please. No. I hate you. You're a bitch. Oh, good, a cleric. <laughs> Archer. The brother. Brother. <laughs> and the druid. The druid. So he goes to the whoever has, whoever the, has the most of those two. Yes. All right. So. Then this one go to me. <laughs> I'll go to yes. make a big fucking play here. And uh, I think the brothers go to you too, Evan. Yeah, the brothers go to you as well. Brothers go to me too. Yep. Mm. Oh, we gotta draw and yes. build so first. I need, we just need a room card. Oh, I also got my ability. For the rest of the game, once per turn, when a monster room is discarded or destroyed, you may put it in your hand. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm good. I, I got nothing to play. You can get your fucking ability here, Cody. All right. So I put a room down, yep. and I will also activate. Um, where the fuck did I go? That one was hold help one. Yes, that was the washer machine. Dryer. Dryer. Sorry. I activate secret stash, turning this room into a cleric symbol. Okay. Just for this turn. It's flip. Not building? No, I didn't know. The decapitator. Haunted at all. Okay. So, Cody, you have two cleric symbols. And um, you level up. Yep, I also activate <laughs> my effect, choose a hero in town, immediately kill that hero, and then place it face down, so I'll kill the brothers. Nice. Although that was like Evan's biggest threat that would have wounded him. Well, isn't that the only one that was going to Evan, or was there another one? That I don't know. Doesn't know. He, I had I was the, getting the druid. druid. Uh, I should have targeted the druid instead, then. All right, let's send so cleric. I'm against the druid. Uh, Cody, you have the most cleric symbols, so. I also have two treasures now, so I also get the thief. Yep. Steven, you can you can put them in any order. The archer goes to you. Yes, the archer goes to me. We're building dungeons. It's like a dean. It's kind of, it's kind of. It's, it's more like a video game dungeon. Probably. Yeah. So uh, this is called boss monsters, and basically the gist of the game is each of us have our own boss monster card, uh, and your goal is to build a dungeon and try and collect as many souls as possible. You want your boss to get up to 10 souls. If he takes 5 wounds, which means to make it through your dungeon without being killed, then you lose uh, your boss monster. And if the first person gets to 10 souls, it will be the last boss monster standing. There's my dead Yes, there's boss. Emmy's dead boss monster. Uh, okay. About 12. Uh, I'm going to uh, put an assassin on the archer. Is a plus three health. I'm gonna play uh, Pity. Choose one hero and an opponent's dungeon and move that hero from the game. So. 
So it's, oh yeah, it's anyway. So, put it I was going to put it back in the pile. Okay. I mean, I guess can you I can look a, at it like Can I get a spell card? No. Please be your own DM. That's kind of, that is a pretty good way of looking at it. Alright. Wrathful DM is trying to kill all the players. Yeah, sounds about right. Archer, enter. I'm going to play. It's on. Uh, instantly oh, kill oh. a hero in my dungeon. Starts to move through the decapitator room, takes two damage. Um, activate Firebolt, heal one to six damage to one hero in your dungeon. Five. So I gotta do math, so that's seven. Yes. Uh, that's six. Four, two, dead. And when you build this room, choose. Oh, yeah. So yeah, this one's dead. Alright, so we got four points. Uh, boom, boom, does. If a hero dies in this room, you may immediately build another room in your dungeon. Yep, five. You can choose to build another room if you wish. Is it automatically built or is it just face down? It's so? automatically built. Alright. You can only have five rooms in Yeah, so it has to be on top. It has to be on what? It has to be on top of one of your three six and rooms, because you can only oh. have five rooms in total. So I would suggest That's one. actually better. Yeah. Magnetic ceiling. Once per turn, if the hero enters this room with an attached item, you may place that item face down in your square keeping area. Yes, so you can choose to get rid of that kind of drawn card if you want to keep it. Keep it. it doesn't miss damage. Alright, so this homie's nice. got eight, one, er, three, five, seven, dead. Yep, okay, so far you're at six points. He's a, he's a high gay man. It's hot. This guy's hot man. dead. Okay, seven points. Yeah, eight points. And then a cleric. Hmm. The cleric and the thief. Uh, fucking freeze. Okay. Activate Lightning Bolt, dealing uh, 3 damage, and then I discard a spell card to do another 3. So pull 6 damage to the B. So he's at 7. And you're this at... This one's frozen? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I think... Yep, he dies. Yep. And this one, he dies. Did he die? Because yeah. that card's still frozen. So that's 0. Oh yeah. Well, he still has the... Um, oh no, he only has 3 damage. That's right. Oh. So yeah, this guy does make it 3 damage, just me for 2. Alright, but it takes two wounds. I want to win the game right there. Damn. It does that not win? Uh, two, two, four, six, eight. Oh, it does win. Huh. Okay, Cody wins. Way to go, Sam. I was waiting for. Oh, because I had Assassin. I was going to play Assassin on him. Fucking why didn't you play it? Because <laughs> I thought that was, he was at nine points. <laughs> Oh my god, Sam. <laughs> he was at 9 points, I'm like, oh cool, I can save this for someone else later. God damn it. I'm so glad that I actually had Secret Stash, because I wanted all the clerics to come once I built my fucking room. You had up. the answer in your fucking hand. Not only that, I also had fear in my hand too. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> you gotta stop that. I stopped you. That wasn't the problem that turn. I mean, you were at the beginning. I, 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 I get to draw a spell card, because he earned two more souls than me. Oh, fuck! I could've used that! It's not a good one. But you, you couldn't use it secondary effect like I could. Ugh, God. <laughs> GG, well played. <laughs> Fucking A, Sam. Who was gonna run? My poor clips. Alright. Do we have time for another one? Uh, let me see what time we're at. Uh, no, we don't. No. We gotta start you, yep. Yeah. Right. Okay. Lost one, two. Thank you, uh, Next Gen and Poppy, for coming in and hanging out. Uh, we're gonna clean up real quick, and we'll be back in about ten or so minutes to start up Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh my goodness, What's up? You made one of the cameras slightly different size. Oh yeah. And that's driving me nuts. Oopsies. Another raptor will let out the skin. Yep.
Because I had the rest of the heroes. Cool. Alright. Alright, end the stream real quick. Like I said, we'll be back 10 15 minutes or so to start Yu Gi Oh! We just gotta clean everything up, readjust the cameras and everything. Um, so, we'll be right back. <laughs>